Hey, what's happening over here? Let's get unboxing this wash and cure. Using a box cutter, which I didn't, and probably why I struggled, uh, we can first see the accessory box, which sits right on top. Inside of this box are going to be some small accessories to help keep you going with both wash and cure functions. We've got some adhesive pads and some hex wrenches as well as a platter for curing your objects, an insertable piece to hold the build plate as it drip dries, and lastly, reflective material to aid in the curing of the underneath of your prints while they're on the platter. Let's get back to the rest of the unboxing. We're going to slide the base of this upside down and be really careful because there's an LED tower that goes down quite far into the box. So now we're going to take the sheath off and expose this LED array on the tower. I can't forget to mention this swivel head that allows you to adjust for the size of your parts. Nice. The next piece to pull out is going to be the bucket. And this includes some other pieces that are going to be part of the accessories and the power supply. Lastly, we're going to pull out the cover and this is going to top off this all-in-one obelisk that you're going to use for post-processing. I'm going to take a look at the box and discard it, but don't discard your box. Always hold on to original packaging. 